Hey, orange one here. We're back with Chip Chop, and uh, thank God for video games, man. I just had one of those days where um, <laughs> I, yeah, I needed, I needed this. Let's just say that. Um, we're not going to pick up that metal folding chair. It doesn't look like we can actually deconstruct stuff. Um, basically, what we're doing, in case you've forgotten, if it's been, if you haven't watched these in a while, like how I haven't played this in a little while, um, I believe last off we were trying to do a quest where we were trying to uh, find the secluded merchant uh, located east along the road that runs through this lair of Eogus, which we we don't know this Eogus character. Um, do we? It says two parsangs west and one parsang north of Joppa. So if we look at the map, uh, how do we exit out of the map? Um, it's not M, is it? No. No, it's like, uh, no. Gosh, what is it? <laughs> what is map? <laughs> it's It's been that long. <laughs> I've, I've tried the tilde key and it's not that. I've tried tab. What is map? Um, yeah, I'm not seeing it. Why am I... Why can't I think of this? Jesus. This is bad. My brain's just like totally spacing on it. Um, God. <laughs> Okay, just give me a second. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm pretty sure that we are actually underground. So, um, we actually need to go upstairs to, um, to go find that, that ruin. Were we exploring ruins then down here? Is that what we were doing? Okay, that's being built then, if that is what we were doing. Was I just doing, like, some deep cave diving over here? Uh, what is that? If I want to look, I'm like using cataclysm controls. A stasis miner. Um, I don't think I want to fight you. But I'm not sure. How's that, uh, that boar doing there? Is that boar hostile to me? It is. Okay, well, I could, I could take out a boar. Where are you, boar? Um, let's see, if I do my abilities, can I charge him? No, I don't think so. Yeah, you need to be two spaces away. Let's just let him come up close then. Um, I think, yeah. I'm trying to wait and I just realized that my control for wait isn't mapped or something. Kind of weird. Weight should be right there. Yeah. Wait, hold on. I didn't save that, did I? <laughs> Apologies. Yeah, so anyways, I went and the reason that I, I was like, oh man, I need these video games right now is um I was just looking at a rental that we're going to be getting and it's just like, it's kind of depressing, you know, sometimes when you just realize what you can afford. I don't know about you guys, but I'm like, I'm getting to almost 30. And... It's upsetting when you go to a rental and you're like, dude, this place isn't even clean. You know? Like, I understand living like this as a college student, but I'm an adult, man. Like, it's like, seriously, there was hair, like, in the bathtub. It's like, what? Like, seriously? Yeah, it was kind of weird. In any case, it's like, okay, well, at least I can go have my power fantasies and my alternative reality and not, like, <laughs> realize that my day-to-day -day life what it is you know i mean I've, I've got a lot to be grateful for i don't want to be ungrateful let's see d for dismember um what did i dismember there um mobility impaired i'm not seeing she's missing her right hind foot okay Hindfoot, that's weird. It affects her left missile weapon. 
Oh, I bet she like just doesn't have access to those slots or something normally. I mean, I could easily get away from you if I really wanted to, but we're not going to. Um, let's just wait. Yeah, we're healed up. I think um, just because there's hostiles nearby. Okay, yeah, so we can um, exit this map. Uh, can I do another dismember? Yes, I can. Take that. Um, if I try and leave, yes, I can kind of look around here. So... Is that... That's the lair of Eogus. Really? I'm really far away from there. What is... That's so weird, because if I look at my quests... Um... It says located east along the road. Oh, so I just went east. I should have seen that it's of this lair and I know where the lair is. Okay, well, I uh, I got a ways to go. <laughs> um, let's go back down where I was. And let's just heal up a little bit then. I think someone's shooting at me. If they're not shooting at me, they're shooting at something else. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's someone trying to take pot shots at me with like that crummy gun, like musket gun thing. Um, we're good to go though. Let's just go, and I'm gonna just let the game uh, investigate a lair. No. Uh, we're lost. Never mind. I guess maybe we're gonna have to investigate that lair. We'll see. Oh look, there's a road. A baboon through what at me um oh man there's a lot of snap jaws can i kill that snap jaw and now we gotta kill these other snap jaws yeah we're fine though we're we're a pretty strong axe lad oh man what happened there they get like a bunch of stones thrown at them yeah these baboons they they be throwing them stones uh Looks like we're going to have to kill you. And I'm actually kind of hurt right now. Let's see. Um, dismember. Let's dismember the monkey. Oh, just straight up killed the monkey. Did not need to dismember. Are you hostile? No, you are not. Okay, cool. Then we're cool. I don't need to fight you. If you don't need to find me, fight me, Mr. Skunk. I mean, don't get me wrong. I'm... There's a lot of good things. I need to be positive about the, the new place, but... What's this feathered? Oh, okay. Not worth it then. And it's actually a super cool place that... Um, why is this not working? Why is my weight not seeming to work? And I'm actually really excited because I'll be living um, right next to a metro station, which I've never done. And I'm, I know it sounds so stupid, but like I'm so excited to be able to take good public transportation. Like as an American, I don't know how many of my viewers are actually American or not. Um, but as Americans, we never get that. I've I honestly have never lived good ne uh, next to good uh, public transportation. And I've lived in plenty of cities. It's not really been... The case for me unfortunately there we go take that hunter um let's see looks like the the hermit is fighting him is the hermit there yeah we're cool he seems to be fine with me i need to regain my bearings so we can get out of here i also need to figure out how to do the waiting because that's really annoying there we go got a little experience um, I almost want to attack that dude. Yeah, I and mean, he's only got ring mail, so... But, I mean, ring mail is actually pretty good compared to what I've got, right? Let's look at what I've got. Oh, no, I actually have ring mail. Uh, can I... I cannot repair that. That is a shame. Okay, well, no point in killing you if I've got the same armor as you. I'm going to go along the road because... I'm pretty sure that will help me get bearing better. Maybe not. 
Is that Baboon up there? Yeah. He's in sprint and range. You messed with the wrong axe man, dude. Yeah, I, I really like Chip Chop's name. It's probably one of my favorite things about <laughs> this character. It's just his name. Thank you again to those of you who helped me name him. Um, with the votes that I did. Yeah, I uh, I have over the last like few years. Oh, whoa, that was loud. Um, mostly biked to work, and so although I haven't had good public transportation, I had good. Um, I mean, it was an okay bike ride. It wasn't the best bike ride. Definitely a little sketch. Wait, did our what happened? My helmet is it no longer cracked? What? Did you guys see that? Wasn't that just cracked? I didn't replace it with anything. Um, so we leveled up. Let's see. I know. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> that little voice. It's like all I'm hearing right now. Even with the game volume turned all the way up, I'm barely hearing that. Huh. That's pretty quiet then. It's probably super quiet for you guys. Get I, I might need to change the in-game audio. I don't know why it's so dang quiet. Um, let's see. So I wanted to go here. No tribute points. Okay, so we can only do skills. We got 160. I think I was trying to... Yeah, like, we could do charging strike. I think that was one of the things that I was trying to do. Yeah, that doubles my chance to dismember. We're totally doing that charging strike. You kidding me? Okay, we're going to start charging at some fools. It's going to be fun. There's a lot of, like, goats there fighting something. Oh, the goat gained a level. Congratulations, goat. Um, <laughs> Do I want to try killing the three goats? Yeah. Let's try and kill the three goats. Um, you, you miss. Oh, great. I missed that first strike. Let's inflate our axons. And let's do a little flurry then. And maybe a little dismember. Okay, they are hurting. But I don't know. Let's see. What, what can I do here? I'm going to try one more... No, we'll do another one. Okay, cool. So one of them is down. This one is wounded, and I look like I'm still going real fast. But I'm gonna start getting slowed down pretty soon. Um, I need to be careful here, because... Oh, actually, did I just cleave him? Cool. Alright, so they're actually gonna start taking a lot more damage. I begin bleeding. Okay, so I'm bleeding now. Um, I bet we can stop that stop that blood loss though. I'm just gonna walk it out just a little bit. Yeah, we stopped bleeding. Cool. All right, so we just killed those goats. Nice. Uh, can I? Uh, let's just cook a little something. Yeah, we can't make anything special. The controls for this game always mess with me because it looks so similar to Cataclysm. And I just like kill that thing. I'm just curious as to how this will go. If I try and then flurry. Oh my god, it's like pretty much dead. Yeah, it's dead. Okay, that was only 12 XP. Um, let's see. We'll go with charge. Sure. Um, there isn't really anything else that I can do. Anything special, at least. Is that other goat coming? Yeah, they are. Um, can I get further away from the goat or no? It doesn't look like it. It looks like they're pretty much my speed. Ah, I got, I got away. Let's see what we do. Nice. Okay. And there we go. That one's down. And I think. I'm just going to get out of here because I don't know why I'm fighting goats just randomly for 12 experience because that's like nothing. 
and chip chop he's meant for bigger and i was i was gonna say better but then i almost said batter and then i think that that sounds pretty cool we'll go with that bigger and batter things um i'm just gonna hang out over here where the sniper can't hit me and just kind of look around yeah he's trying to can't hit me but he definitely is trying to oh somebody just threw a threw a grenade at me oh man what is going on with the flashing dude um they're they're actually hurt so we're fine cool that one's down and these other ones are, don't look too bad to me yeah this one's gonna go down in no time there we go. Easy. Got you know, gotta sharpen our axe on a on something. As they say, right? What is the effect that those guys are getting from that cloud? I am I am a little bit curious. Yeah, it's weird going from like our other character what was his name? I can't even remember what our other caves of cut character was named. But going from them where they had the like Aegon rifle and were just like blasting people with like laser weapons and now I'm like some like human, some ignorant human swinging around an axe like I'm from like the Holy Nation in Kenshi. Trying to destroy everything that is not pure. <laughs> oh man, I just got like a little heart twinge there. Ow. I've been getting more of those recently. I think I told some people on the channel that I've been getting those chest pains. Definitely gotta take that. Jewel encrusted sword, you kidding me? But yeah, it was from school, but now it just seems to be hitting me randomly. I'm not sure why. Or it's kinda hard to predict exactly when it's gonna happen. Like that was like there was no reason for me to be getting chest pain there. You would think it would be like uh stress induced, which it is somewhat, but it isn't always. Six pound, that's probably a gun then, right? Um, let's try and examine it. Yeah. Nice. We got ourselves a shoddy if we need it. Um, let's see. Right missile weapon. Yeah, we'll go with the pump shotgun. Oh, hold on. Is it real? Nice. Oh, it, it only can hold one at a time, right? I forgot that. All right, well, we have that. That's kind of nice if we need it. I don't think we're going to really use it, though. Uh, is that Puma? It looks like they killed it. Okay. Can I actually... Oh, I'm, I'm still lost? Okay, Grove of the Shrewd Ghost. That has to be... Uh, that has to be good now. The guard dog barks. So, who's this ghost character that I just heard about are they an actual character or is this just like an empty place because i'm oh no there's someone over there apple farmer okay so this is i thought it was the apple farm but is it i guess also a shrine like apple farmers got like a little cult apple farmers yeah both of them are apple farmers Excuse me, guys, I'm just gonna... Uh, oh, what? I'm still lost? I could have sworn that I got the message saying that you're not lost anymore. Okay. Well, I guess we're just gonna have to keep on wandering through. <laughs> Here we go. I think it's a good volume, right? The game volume. In the background there. Kinda hard to tell. But I got the, the impression that it might be a little quiet. So apologies if it is. Because um, I know that always bothers me when it's like, where's the game audio? If it is, I'll 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 fix it for the next one. Don't worry. No, I think this is the same settings that I had for the other um, series. So I would be shocked if it had issues. Oh, you guys are at attacking me. I wasn't realizing that. Hmm. I like don't even I didn't even need my inflated axons, that's nice. Oh man, really? Okay, these salamanders I guess don't like me anymore. 
That's fine. They're a good amount of experience, so I'll take that. Why? Yeah, okay. I thought he was chasing me like... Oh my god! What? What happened there? You know what, buddy? Yeah. Thanks. Um... Okay, I need to figure out how to do the waiting. This is not working because we need to be able to wait here. I I thought I had that as here. Yep. And oh, I guess I didn't hit save. There we go. Beautiful. <laughs> All right. I guess we'll keep on rolling because I'm. Oh, finally. We're no longer lost. There are hostiles nearby. Of course there's hostiles nearby. Just had a grenade thrown at me. I know there's hostiles. Um, so I think we wanted to be... What was it for the location? Two Parsangs west and one north of the ruins of Joppa. So two west and one north of Joppa. Where's Joppa at? Isn't Joppa, like, around here somewhere? Oh gosh, do I not know where Joppa is? You can't sprint on the world map? Oh, wrong. I want to go down. Because I'm pretty sure that Joppa is, like, right around here. Somewhere. It's not this tile. It's gotta be one of the tiles nearby. Uh, outskirts Joppa, Joppa. Oh, so this is Joppa. Oh, this is the ruins of Joppa. Oh, so Joppa is just a bunch of ruins in this, in this world. Interesting. Okay, so we need to go, um, hold on. The, so it's just telling me to go here then, to the lair. Uh, go to the lair, sure. Hopefully I don't die there. Um, so it said follow the road east of this lair, right? For that quest. Um, merchant of the consortium along the road that runs through the lair. Okay, so there's some sort of road that runs through this lair or something. Okay, so here's the road, right? So, this road seems to go east of here. Yep, definitely right here. Okay, looks good. There's gotta be a merchant somewhere along this road. Now, what I am confused about is how far he is, or if he's gonna be right by the road. Because if he's not right by the road, I'm gonna miss him. Because I'm... I can't see very far right now, as you can probably notice. We'll follow this road for a little while, see what we find, and if we don't find the... the merchants, then, um, I don't know. We'll see. It's gotta get to daytime soonish, though, right? Yeah, I don't know, like, with the rentals I've had in the past, like, it's not... I, I had kind of just accepted it, um... I think that the the thing that's hard for me is that I thought at this point that I would be like owning a home, you know, like honestly. And so like kind of like looking at that expectation versus reality, I think is why I, I got so hit with like hard looking at that rental, you know. How do I smash with this stuff? I wanted to do like smashing in a certain direction. I've forgotten how to do that. No. If that was control and then like certain directions, that does not look to be a, what it is. Okay, well we'll keep on going and hopefully we find our, our merchant. Because the road seems to continue. Right? Yeah, look! We found the merchant apparently. I mean, I, I didn't, but the game says we did. So they must be on this tile somewhere. Okay, um, where? 
I mean, it says they're along the road, so I'm looking along the road. I also need to be careful because they may look like a plant. You know? Um, what's the auto explorer? Isn't zero auto explorer or something? I can't remember. Yeah, the this item person. I'm not seeing them. Oh, is that them? Odd hued glow plat. Oh, so this is a famous one that's hated. Um, oh, it's loved by the consortium of the fight. Oh, it's running a small shop. Oh, so this is the merchant then. Hello. Oddly hued glow pad. That is really cool. Um, super cool. <laughs> super random. Look at this. Look at this. This is so random. Um, I mean, we could get some artifacts. There's quite a few artifacts that we that they have there. I don't think I can afford any of them. Yeah, now I know where they are. Psst. Oh, what's that? What's this? Hold on. Find the oddly hued glow pad. Oh, that's that is an achievement. Oh. <laughs> so do I need to, like kiss it or something to get like turn into a princess? Snowflake spinner folk. Cannibals, birds. Um, sure. Maybe you can teach me something. I want. I want to learn what you can teach me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know people don't like me doing that. Water sib. <laughs> that is strange. Snake oiler. That's definitely not worth it. Okay, well, that is a shame that we uh we lost so much re reputation with people. At least the at least the consortium, like one of the most rare factions in the game, at least they like us. Um okay well <laughs> that quest's done. Now I don't know what to do. Let's have a look. I think we could honestly just explore and kill go kill some stuff and that would be good. I'm just curious with quests, um We'll go. I suppose we could try and get to the six days still. I doubt that we're going to at this point in the game. Eh, eh, I don't see the harm in it. It's a, let's go down here and we'll go into the no man's land. The six days still can be a little bit more difficult than this area. This area is just like the baby zone and like seeing how we're going tro true can, we don't really need to do that. But here we could get into some interesting fights with the uh, like the sand people. Honestly, how do I switch this side? This drives me bonkers. I'm just pressing buttons right now, just seeing if there's a way there. If there is, I can't find it. So, is, is this salt water? This is salt water, right? It's just salt. Is a river of salt, you know, no big deal. So, hey, I saw that um, something in Caves of Cud that this is supposed to be in like the Middle East, but they um, they didn't want to make it super explicit because they didn't want to be like political or anything. But what would you like to see in the game that would make it a little bit more tied to the real world, or would you? Would you want to see anything that ties it more to the real world? Because, like, it's an interesting idea that this is the Middle East with, like, mutants and stuff. But I just feel like at the same time that it's just not that. Oh, what what do we have here? Um, that's a lot of new right there. Hindran of Bela. Just like by the Babins. What's Bela again? Isn't that, um... I mean, they might be a good person for me to befriend. Definitely don't want to kill them. Oh, hello. I should have charged you. Flurry. Uh, dismember, definitely. Oh, wow, this guy's really messing me up, actually. Um, hmm. 
Can we fight them? Is my concern is that we're not going to be able to actually take them. It says that they're tough, actually, so I don't know if we can actually fight these guys. Oh man, this might be the end of Chip Chop. Uh, can I sprint and get away from him? I don't think I can get away from you. Um... I mean, I can charge him. And they are injured, actually, from the bleeding. So if I try and go to charge, I can charge them. Did I even hit them? Let's inflate those axons. Uh, and... If I need to, I've got an acid gas grenade. Can I try and shoot him? Um, that kind of hurt them. Uh, they're okay. This is oh, we did it. We didn't die. <laughs> and now the music's getting so much louder. It's like oh my god. And then we ate a meal and it changed. <laughs> or not. Never mind. <laughs> oh man. Is it just me or does it sound like there's multiple soundtracks going on at the same time? Okay, I'm gonna end this here. Thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One.